Our travel is now take us here to Middletown, Connecticut. We're downtown on Main Street, Jim Masters Connecticut Perspective TV. We're inside what they call the Main Street Market. I mean, all kinds of great places in this little marketplace. One great place is El Popo Tapas Bar and Mediterranean Cuisine. Yeah, we're gonna try some tapas, hot and cold. They all, oh my God, they do so many great things like Red Snapper, they do skirt steak, and they do all kinds of fabulous Mediterranean dishes from scratch. So we're gonna go in, we're gonna sample, we're gonna check it out, and as always, we're gonna enjoy. Here we go. We're here with Chef Carlos Guzman and with Christian, and we're gonna make something really special here at the restaurant. What do we make, guys? So chef Carlos Guzman will be preparing our octopus-inspired risotto. Now this chef prepares the cut, another tentacle, and this will be the main focal point of the dish, the pulpo-inspired dish. Yeah. Those are all the ingredients. Chef lays olive oil, fine-pressed garlic, shallots. Now our staple to the dish, the octopus. A little bit of company, some lobster. Now you saute it all together. Next, a little bit of cream. Now the chef's special cream, which is saffron infused, or pre-made Spanish rice. Now everything's being sauteed together and mixed up. And what you're looking for is a nice velvety texture to the rice. The tarragon. Now some saffron. Seems to be the main dish to a lot of our Spanish dishes here. You continue sauteing and mixing everything up. A little bit of salt to taste. Now he's done here. A little olive oil to the pan. Nice fine pressed garlic, fine sliced octopus tentacle goes in entirely. A little bit of Spanish white wine. It's more of the chef's saffron infused cream. Now the chef's just moving around the octopus, around the tentacle like risotto. Sauteed octopus. Now the sauteed sauce. It's layered upon the plate. Let's add a bit more of tarragon. This looks delicious, chef. Going to sample it for all of our fabulous viewers. Bravo, okay. bravo, that is delicious. <laughs> Doesn't that look fantastic? Thank you, Chef and Christian. Oh, look at that, huh? Would you want that? We're here once again with Christian Pagan, and we're going to talk about some of these incredible dishes in just a moment. But first, I want to ask you, Christian, now this restaurant has tapas, hot and cold tapas, so we're seeing it on the menu. Tell us, for viewers watching right now who maybe they've heard what tapas is, but they're not quite clear on what tapas offers. Tapas are smaller dishes, and if you think of tapas, think of you know, modern appetizers, and that's what a lot of restaurants do, appetizers. But majority of our menu, I would say half our menu, focuses on the tapas. Some of these dishes here look absolutely incredible. Can you tell us about the dishes? What do you, what do you have in front of you there? That looks delicious. Plate right in front of me. Um, when the guests come in, they won't find this on the menu. The reason why, is the chef's hidden staple tip. Right. Christian, everybody knows about paella, but they might not realize that there are different kinds of paella, right? This looks to be maybe the traditional kind. Am I right? That traditional paella um, goes by the name of the Paella Valenciana. And that consists of best of both worlds. You get some meat and you get some seafood. And, you know, you just can't go wrong. Now, do you do specials? I saw something about prefix on the menu. During the week, we have a prefix. On so Monday and Tuesday, we offer a $20 prefix. So the guest comes in and we have a nice, wonderful menu the chef came up with. You choose a tapa, an entree, and dessert that comes with it. So for $20. Um, Wednesday, we have paella nights. Chef comes in, um, guests come in, and the chef has provided a handful of payas that we're making in house on top of our Valenciana, and that's at a reduced price. Fantastic. Well, we wish you continued success. This looks outstanding. I'm going to sample this and this and this and this. Thank you very much, Christian. We appreciate it. And thanks for having us here. Thank you. Best of luck. Delicious, every bite was incredible. It's a great place, El Polpo Tapas Bar, Mediterranean cuisine right here in Middletown in the Main Street Marketplace. They get lots of good food, it's a beautiful atmosphere, it's priced right, and you will enjoy it. Here we are in Middletown, El Polpo, on Connecticut Perspective.